Hi, Mr. Mayor, it's a personal privilege of mine to have been asked to say something on your birthday. First of all, let me say happy birthday. The next thing I want to say is it's been a personal privilege of mine to have known you these many years that I have and to have been a member of your winning team. I'm now the member of another winning team, the Ford team. And on behalf of uh, Ford Motor Company and all of the employees at Avis Ford, I just want to say to you, happy birthday. Finally, if you're at three score and ten, can I be far behind? Happy birthday. I'm ready. In five, four, three. Mr. Mayor, it's a personal privilege of mine to have been asked to say just a couple of words on your birthday. First of all, happy birthday. I also want to say that it's been a personal privilege of mine to have been a part of your winning team all these many years. I'm now the member of another winning team, the Ford team. And on behalf of the Ford Motor Company and all of my employees at Avis Ford, the dealership with the heart, we want to say happy birthday to you. In closing, let me just say that if you are at three score and ten, can I be far behind? Happy birthday. Mr. Mayor, it's a personal privilege of mine to have been asked to say a couple of words on your birthday. First of all, happy birthday. I also want you to know it's been a privilege of mine to have been a part of your winning team for all these many years. I'm now the member of another winning team, the Ford team. And on behalf of the Ford Motor Company and all of the employees at Avis Ford, the dealership with the heart, we say happy birthday. Finally, if you are at three score and ten, Coleman, can I be far behind? Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Mr. Mayor. I wanted to bring greetings personally for two reasons. One, as a practicing lawyer and as a past president of the Wolverine Bar Association from 78 to 79, and as past president of the National Bar Association from 83 to 84, and then as president of the State Bar of Michigan in 84 and 85, you've made a tremendous impact upon how lawyers who are minorities are treated in all of America. Many marvel at what you were able to accomplish when you first came into office and you decided in your infinite wisdom that you wanted to see a joint venture between a majority law firm and a minority law firm that resulted in Detroit having the first black law firm of any law firms in America to be listed in the Red Book to do bonding work. The stories about what you've accomplished as mayor on behalf of minority lawyers who live and work in your city are legion. And you should be proud of that as you reflect upon the years of service as mayor of our great city. Next, I think it is awfully important that those of us who look at law enforcement are mindful of what you were able to accomplish without a lot of fight, but with fortitude to bring about a police force that we enjoy today that is representative of a community. 
as you reflect upon your years of service as mayor and as you think about your birthday, remember all of the people in the city of Detroit who were at one time afraid to call the police but no longer have that fear because of what you've been able to do to integrate our police force. Allow me to wish you a happy 70th birthday. And I might add that we look forward to your continued service as mayor of the city of Detroit for the next election coming up and as long as you seek elected office. Happy birthday.